Alright, what's up guys? It's Zayo here and today I'm going to be teaching you all about building and building techniques and the best strategies, the best building pieces to use. Just overall the best building strategies for build fights that pro players are using, the top players are using, and that you guys should be too. Basically I'm just going to be trying to teach you guys how to get better at building and build fights specifically. As you know, you're going to end up having build fights in the future at some point if you play this game. Um, and you want to be able to actually win that way every time you get in a build fight you're not losing so first off we're going to start with your ramps right with pushing so when you're pushing you always want to make sure you're putting walls through we're doing a very quick video but i'm going to be going in depth and through a lot of advanced and beginner techniques so some of these you might already know but we're gonna say them anyway so make sure you guys are putting the walls in front and you can put your wall through your ramp same with the floor take out the floor and tape it through the ramp the reason you want to do that is because no matter what they have to break two layers now to knock you down right they got to break that and your ramp whereas if you only put the wall right here they're able to just shoot your ramp under so make sure you guys when you're rushing all right do all three okay if you're not using every single building piece in your build, then you need to work on building. If you guys think you're pretty good at build fights, but you don't use the pyramid, you're not very good. You need to use every single building if you want to become good at build fighting. Obviously, the other ones you use more, but the build, this one is the most effective in build fights. Um, I'm going to show you guys why. So, say someone ramps over your head, right? Like You, you both see each other at the same time. You push up to them. Oh no, he got over my head. You take out your ramp, your pyramid like this, right? And you just place it right there. Now look, he's coned, right? So he's going to be running up and looking to shoot you and boom, he's stuck. Now from that point, you can either A, box him in because look, see that wall there? It places that wall as well through the ramp once you have the pyramid up. Um, so you can either box him in and trap him. Or what you could do, after you pyramid them, just straight uh, run out this way. But you got to make sure you turn around quick in case he's trying to shoot you. But it's going to be hard for him to shoot you because his head's up in there. Um, and either way, that's going to slow him down so much so you have enough time to get high ground. This is why you should be play practicing in playground a lot. Um, just run up, right? And you want to do like, like this. Basically, you basically just want to make almost like a one by one kind of. But you just kind of turning around while protecting yourself okay now the reason you want to do this right there's a guy up to my right a little bit right um when you're pushing you want to build in front of you so that way he can't shoot you and then you can make your turn towards him right or most of the time it's used when someone actually has high ground over you right so uh, what you want to do is double ramp out, right? And again, do the technique, spin around, and it regains you high ground. That is one of the most useful strategies for building. Okay, so another strategy you guys can work on is when you have high ground, right? So let's just say I have high ground and someone's pushing up, right? Like, let's say I'm here and someone's putting their ramps up, right? What you want to do, if you can... Get used to putting floors over them and blocking them. The reason you want to do this is because A, it stops them from getting up to you, but B, you could quickly edit it and shoot them in the face, and it's not going to be expected, right? And you come at different angles. Don't always go straight up, because if they're staring at you, you're going to lose the fight. They actually have an advantage in editing with the pump delay. I know they up the pump. They fix the pump delay a little bit, but... They still have an advantage if they're just aiming at you so make sure when you do it you're like coming at different angles okay practice that as well now another thing you guys need to do when getting uh when practicing building you need to make sure any building technique that comes out guys that's overpowered that the pros are using you know any good building technique that comes out that's actually effective in game you guys need to immediately come into uh playground mode like that like i'm doing and you need to just practice it and perfect that move because everyone thinks there's never going to be any new moves never never every time but guess what there's always new moves coming out um so i know there will be in the future it may not be for a little bit they're coming out slower now obviously people are getting a lot more advanced into building but for example i'll show you a technique that just came out 
and I instantly went to playground to learn it. Here it is again. All right, this is like when someone puts a floor over you. Now I was talking about putting floors over you, right? Well, this is when someone has high ground, right? They put a floor over you. So your first reaction, when someone puts a floor over you guys, this is another good thing to practice. If you're pushing up, someone puts a floor, boom, pyramid. Now they can't edit their floor, okay? So, all right, he has the floor, and I'm pushing him. Put the pyramid. Oh, I messed up. See, I, I haven't practiced this one in a minute. And boom, retake high ground. Again, he puts the floor, you put the pyramid. Boom. Uh, the reason this is such an effective strategy, right? Here, let me show you guys. So he's going to be on the high ground. Right, he's going to be right about here. And he's going to put a floor here. Okay, so when you're going, put the pyramid. Boom, look at that, double ramp, so... That is just so overpowered because if he's standing here, he's not able to shoot you because you're double ramping. This pyramid Fs him up, so he has to either run over top of it and build up, or he's got to go like this to build up. He can't just normally ramp up. But also, when you put this pyramid, he's going to be trying to edit and get stuck here for a second. Then he's going to try and shoot you. There's not many people who are just straight up going to run up. If someone strictly does that, I think they don't know what they're doing, so they should be easy enough to kill anyway. Anyway guys, thanks for watching the video, and go ahead and follow me on Twitter, Instagram, Twitch, and go ahead and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Don't forget to hit that like button, and comment down below if I helped you learn something, or any new uh, techniques that you guys learn, or what I could do to improve my videos. Thanks again guys, and peace out.